welcome guys in this tutorial i will be teaching you how to convert your dot dll to dot aax if you're a pro tools user this is for you now in your pro tools for example pro tools 12 you are never going to have a vst extension with dot dll so how then do you convert your dll extensions that you already love using in other plugins for example in your pro tools to dot aax to do this very simple you're going to need a trans vst now trans vst is a tool you're going to need to convert your plugin from dll to dot aax for example in this in my folder bridge folders i have a lot of dot um, dll files which is in 64 uh, 64 bits now you have hypersonic here look at this you see it's not wrapped yet it's no so all you need to do is click on wrap once you click wrap you see it's it has changed the status to yes it has been wrapped simply meaning that uh, uh, hypersonic 64.dll has been converted now to hypersonic 64.ax but that's not done yet you need to still fix it now to fix this you have to quickly look for how to uh, find out you go to your um, file right up rather right your c you go to your program of course you have to find your 64 bit okay here you have the parent name for trans vst is sugar bytes so in my sugar byte folder here i have it then open your trans vst now you have the trans vst fixer so this is what you need to convert uh, what has been done in ax to actually fix so you can use this plugin right in your Pro Tools. Now the next thing you have to quickly do is to look out for the folder where the file that you have just converted, okay? You have, let's open your folder so we don't have to close the initial one. Now in this folder you have program files, you have, you have to go to the x86 which is your 32 bits. Open it quickly and then you go to common files we're talking about pro tools here so you have to look for avid parent name audio then you find plugins now here you're going to find hypersonic 64 act this is just the file that was created earlier on so you open contents open 64 now you have it you're going to fix this quickly now take this one drop right inside your fixer so it convert it, you have this press any key to continue all right so you click this now you have modified this modified file is what you need so you quickly cut in my own case i'm going to cut because i'm going to discard the modified folder then i come in here and drop to replace what i have already here so now you have to remove this modified now if you go back quickly you realize that the folder you have now is what you need to work with in your Pro Tools. So what you have to do is copy. Then do not forget you need to place this in your 64 bit. So you just do the, exactly the same thing what you did to come down to your 32 uh, bits. So you go back to your 64 bit. You need to place it here right now. Okay. Common files are made. We are in 64 bit now. Add audio plugins. So here you have to place um, your plugin just here okay which is the one you're bringing down you just find a way to click you have paste replace so, okay now you have your hypersonic 64 dot axe plugin right here in your 64 bits now simply means that you can now use this in pro tools because it has been converted fixed so in your pro tools you can use your dot axe which has been converted from your dot dll in your purchase please in case you have any questions feel free to ask me and i'll be glad to answer you thank you for being part of this